This is the Thank You Ocean Report, and today we talk about a citizen science project called the California King Tides Initiative. We use the term King Tide to refer to tides that are above average and the highest winter tide. Hilary Papendick is a NOAA Coastal Fellow at the California Coastal Commission. And it occurs when the sun and the moon are in alignment, and although there are these high tides throughout the entire year, the California King Tide publicizes the winter tides. Because these are the tides that are most likely to produce the highest surges. And what is the California King Tides Initiative? The California King Tide Initiative is a partnership between federal, state, and nonprofit organizations. It's one of many King Tide initiatives throughout the United States and the world. There are also initiatives in Australia and British Columbia. And we mentioned that the King Tides Initiative is a citizen science project because it's asking you to participate by taking photos along the California coast. These photographs can give scientists and decision makers an idea of how sea level rise might impact the coast. And it uses the power of the public and people throughout the entire state to go out and take photos of their area and then create a database of photos, hopefully throughout every single California community and coastline area. As Hillary mentioned, king tides can be huge, but another factor this year is the prediction that El Nino could produce even higher tides. Sometimes up to a foot higher than our normal water levels. There is, of course, a caution here. We don't want you out in the surf or in danger of any kind. And also what scientists and researchers are really looking for is the impact of these tides on infrastructure. We are hoping for images that show how higher water levels interact with the developed coastline. So particularly infrastructure, the flooding of roads, bridges, sometimes the higher water levels can almost be at the level of bridges. The next King Tides are December 12th through the 14th. And it's really easy to get involved. You just need your camera or a smartphone. You go out, look at what time the highest tide is expected to be in your area and take photos of areas where you can see the water in relation to some kind of development along the coastline. And then post those photos to our Flickr page or share them on Facebook. That's Hillary Papendick with the California Coastal Commission. To learn more about the King Tides Initiative, we have links for you on our website, thankyouocean.org. I'm Jerry Kay.